Hello everyone, I'm Arun Sivai. So I'm here to speak on the topic Parents and Adolescents. It's quite interesting, right? So, how parents are today? Today, the parents are actually, they are more intimate, less hierarchical. They expect a honest and open opinions from their children and also most of them agree their children as their best friends. And they involve their kids in making so many decisions also. Uh, well, when you consider the case for an adolescent, it is important to break gender bias at the younger age. It is needed to create a gender neutral a gender neutral mindset and ensure that they respect the opposite gender. Well, we see nowadays that father also involved in parenting and household works. But yeah, what I say they must because children learn most of the things by observing their parents. So that means if they observe only their mother working at household thing house, then they may feel only females must do that. And also you must express sensitive behavior around them. For example, we see few of the parents who say it is disgraceful for boys. They say it is disgraceful to play with girls, lose to them in a game or cry in front of them. But you must not do that. Because this may trigger them to feel that boys stand higher than girls. Don't become an enemy for your own girl. Always don't mind them that they are girls, that you are a girl and you must not do that, and you must don't uh, what, build a wall around them. It's okay to allow them to play with boys. What I suggest that it is better if you admit you are a kid to go at schools at the younger age only. Because if you don't encourage this, this will create groupism, this will develop a this will make them to develop a groupism kind of nature at the younger age itself. They get alienated from the opposite gender and also they lose that opportunity to develop that sensitive nature towards the opposite gender. So then, how, why is parenting important at the teen's life? Because parents are the ones who are going to influence the appearance, certain behaviors like language use and the social life of the adolescent. And also they are the ones who are going to shape the educational plans, moral and social values and broader worldview. Well, this is the age period where adolescents will fail to make right decisions. But still, they don't like you to make their decisions. So then, how should this be done? Well, this, the painting must shift from making to healthy way. That is, when you are adolescent, at anger, when he or she is at anger age, you are the one who are going to make all the decisions about them. But now, when they are in adolescent age, you must not make the decisions, but instead you must help them to make decisions. There are some positive impacts of parenting in teen's life. Like, it will increase the adolescent self-esteem and positive academic results. You will get positive academic results of the adolescent and happiness and satisfaction about the life. But when the painting is not done properly, this will have some negative impacts also. Like, depressed state of being, alcohol and substance abuse, suicidal thoughts, violent behaviors and other emotional and physical distress. So then, how parenting should be? What I say is it should be of authority type, wherein the parent have high expectations for their children, they give warmth and support for them and there is an open style of communication between the parents and adolescents and you give an appropriate discipline and guidance to them. But parenting should not be like too very authoritarian, permissive type or uninvolved and neglecting type. Well, I have some points that will help and improve 
the positive healthy relationship between parents and children well that is eating meals together this is very effective because nowadays parents cannot give uh, much time with their adolescent or any of the age group of their kid they can't give so much of time in this busy life but this will be more effective if you eat meals together provide warmth and warmth and support this love encouragement and responsiveness these are like the key feature, key elements for an effective parenting create opportunities to talk one must know when their adolescent is having good mood like while watching tv or while playing a game you must know when they are having good mood and you must create opportunities to speak to speak to them openly listen to your adolescent whether they are blabbering nonsense or whatever it is you express you show that you are enjoying what they are seeing and this will not allow them to keep secrets and also uh what don't interrupt to them when they ask for your opinion when they are speaking to you to ask your opinion don't interrupt their talk much because the less you interrupt the more they ask for your opinion and then set clear and consistent limits which are reasonable and make them understand its importance also then monitor your child's activity so that they don't diverge into negative path be open to negotiation as a ch child grows and become an adolescent the rules can become flexible and gradually allow more independence for them so that I, because you can have that trust on them now they will be responsible about their things to a certain level and offer choice for them guide without being too very controlling ask open ended questions and also don't over react when they speak to you or when they ask for your permission or whatever they are speaking with you don't over react for anything don't compare your kid with others because everyone is unique talk early openly and honestly about sensitive topics and risky behaviors also and what i say for parents is that after having a kid or adolescent we see most of the parents quit their job and stop their all other hobbies or works but you must not do that you can continue their things parallelly with parenting also and uh it may surprise few parents that to know that their adolescent kid still loves them and respects them even during that adolescence age well it is not the and also the parenting is having a positive impact on teens life during the adolescent age parenting is very effective so uh, it is neither the mistake of adolescent nor the parent for such uh, violent behaviors so it, it is important for the adolescent to control this violent behavior and also for the parents to see over it in a certain and proper and careful manner thank you